I don't really know how to start this. I found this cool visual novel on the Steam store. I thought I'd play it. It's got a cute handmaker on the front. Like, I'm good with this. This game is called Lingering Fragrant Fragrance, made by Bless Studios. It looks like a nice game. This this is a ceremony for us to get into society and the graduating trip to becoming an adult. This is the last time I'm able to spend with her the couple that is going to separate and the memory that is going to be forgotten. This is the last taste remaining of my youth. Jesus. Alright, let's do this. Start lingering. Achievement unlock project start. Six days left. Five days left. Four days left. Stop going down. There we go. Whew. It's funny, I have four days till I go to college. Fuck. Dot dot dot. Me. Deep breathing. The hell is that? The smell here is different from anywhere else. After breathing in this air, a strange feeling filled the inside of my body. It's been many years since the last time I felt this way. The hell's with this tunnel? When I think to myself, about a half minute has passed. The smell remains deep inside my nose, stimulating my brain constantly. I can't make a person completely relaxed. Oh, it can make a person completely relaxed. Taking you out of yourself. I look at the tipping clock at the top. Where? Only now I clock wearily next to it. What the fuck is this like weird room? It's two hours from my dormitory to here. It only took me just a bit more than an hour this time. It seems like the maglev got faster again. The news might have reported this, but I rarely watch the news. The teacher told us we should put more effort into such things like this, but it's actually not that necessary. Because for us, there is no news worth caring about. Every news reported is good news, and everyone is happy about it. So about the news of the future, I, I don't need to care about those things. Oof. The only thing I care about is... I came too early. Uh, double entendre, mate? I came to a promise to me here at 9.30, so I guess I got some time to kill now. First time I've come here, nothing here is familiar to me. I'm really bad at killing time. Hello! Oh my god. Huh? Has she come already? I look around spotting nothing. This happens to me all the time. Why is this game so dull colored? There we go! Don't worry about that, I'm sorry. <laughs> this happens all the time when trying to find her. It's like she can be invisible. Then a breeze puffed on my back. Which can only belong to her. Ow! Oh my god, that's adorable. <laughs> Stop that, it hurts. Though she is light, every time she dashes and bear hugs me from the back, the impact on my back is still pretty heavy. Let me go, you almost knocked me out. Oh jeez, Daisy, no. <laughs> I want more, oh god. How about changing the position? My back hurts now. And I can't even see your face. Soon dairy bitch much. <laughs> that I can't see her makes me feel weird and in danger. <laughs> what if someone attacks me now? Oops. It was an accident, the maglev got faster again. Oh shit, it actually did. I thought I might be late, but I was wrong. If I had known this earlier, I might have been able to pick you up. <laughs> it wastes too much time. 
Hermes. Jesus, Hermes, but yeah. Mm -hmm. So what are we waiting for? Alright. So I'm guessing they're a couple, and I'm guessing he's in college, and I'm assuming she is as well. The girl jumps up a little. Her little ponytail on the side of her head floats up as well. Her name is Daisy, a carefree girl. My cute girlfriend, and my- Yeah, oh, high school. I was assuming college, with the whole innocence and like, youth dying thing. Uh, actually, we're not classmates anymore. We just graduated- Oh! Fucking Christ. Called it. We just graduated this year, so there's only one relationship left. And today is our graduation trip. It's only two days. Do I have to get the tickets first? Nah. We'll be bound on everyone's ID card so we can just go straight in. That's actually kind of cool. ID cards are almost expired. This is the last time using them, their retirement. I just never thought it would be here. I've never been here. What's it like? <laughs> Is this game Japanese or Korean? I'm now slightly confuggled. Sounds nip on steel, but I'm not too sure. You have been here? One of my friends has been here before. She said it was awesome. <laughs> Blind trust. Jesus Christ, sky high. The Mario part makes me, <laughs> makes me nervous too. I spent money on three things in my life. Food, games, anime and manga. That's about it. Oh, and I have a severe tech addiction, but we don't talk about that one. And soon there'll be no need for us to spend money anymore. Oh God. My expectations are pretty high. I won't let you down. I believe you. <laughs> Through the tunnel, there is a paradise. A theme resort isolated from the rest of the world. Not like these noisy cities, it's pure and beautiful. They say if anyone has been here, they'll experience something just like dreaming. Because of that, everything is very expensive. <laughs> I can feel my wallet crying from here. My god. We have been working two months of part-time jobs for this trip. Even after the off-season discount and many other discounts. God. So, this place sounds expensive, because what I can make in two months at my job, let's see, I make $12 an hour, thank you New England, for having fairly high minimum wage. Well, the minimum wage is 11 this year, and I got a promotion, so 12 bucks. I work around 20-ish hours a week. In two months, I could save up like almost two grand if I really pushed. How expensive is this fucking place? But even though we would have to spend our whole holiday working for this, we still wanted to be here because it's the last two days before we go to college after all. Even if it's only two days, some great memories will be made. Ouch. Is this ticket for the two days? Let me see. Yes, today and tomorrow. Finish the day after tomorrow. Special two days and two nights. Specifically two days and two nights. Right before the holiday ends. Although the holiday wasn't long, it's fulfilling. Aww. I haven't met almost this whole holiday. Because we both had to go to work. I was doing several jobs at the same time to barely earn enough money for this trip. It's hard to find a job before finishing college. Those jobs which are... Especially provided for high school students are all poorly waged. Yeah. Sounds like I didn't work hard enough. I didn't mean that. I know you were fighting for it as well. But spending our whole holiday to be here, do you think it was really worth it? <laughs> Absolutely. Jeez. But there are many other ways to leave a mark on the heart, too. The taking a trip is the most regular. <laughs> I feel like he got roped into this a bit. And then as a result, I had a pretty shitty summer, but I don't, know, don't worry about that part later. Also, the most expensive one he called it. Dude, you're gonna get hit. Fine, fine, don't be mad. 
Although our money is limited, it feels good to spend it like this. Money is useless once we get into college after- Whoa, 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 money is not useless once you get into college. <laughs> I saved the money for fucking college. And I immediately spent a shit ton of it on games like this. And Aozora Mekiu. And Love Kami and Neptunia again. Okay, I have no life. Ah, uh, we're almost at the end. Don't be too surprised. I hate her a little bit. Of what? Holy shit! Spectacular. I've never seen such a view in my whole life. Your smell in the air are even clearer than before. A colorful view and clear blue sky. I've never seen a place like this before. Yeah, I mean... That's genuinely impressive. Like, that place is... If that place was real, I'd spend my entire summer savings to go there for a couple of days. I just need a girlfriend first. <laughs> the greenness on the ground, that's grass. And those things on the grass... I think those might be trees. What the fuck? I've seen photos and models of those paints and plants. What? For the first time... But seeing them together, this is the first... What place... What timeline does this world take like, place in? Like... Is it... Post-industrialized hell? Does he only know what the inner city looks like? Has he never seen a fucking tree? I mean, even in Tokyo, there's a famous forest. Well, outside Tokyo. Let's not get into specifics, I'm not really too good at geography. What do you think, surprise? I'm impressed. But there is actually but there is actually a place like this. It's exciting. Jeez. <laughs> She's so excited. This might actually be Korean now that I think about it. Oh, let's check something. Menu, uh, what language do I get? Nope. That's Nippon Steel. And Korean. That's Japanese. Just never really heard most of these words before. Mm, the smell of the soil. Way clearer than outside. I fully understand why it's so expensive here. These views existed only in photos. These things are from my eyes. They can only be seen as models in the outside world. Even if we could use VR devices to experience these things, their smells can only be smelled here. What the fuck? Please show me your ID card. Do I have to show my ID card here? Here you are. Guest information reading complete. Welcome. You have purchased a couple simple two-day bundle. Uh-huh. <laughs> couple simple. I know what a what couple is, but what does simple mean? <laughs> mm, the cheapest one. <laughs> oh, the cheapest one is that expensive already. <laughs> I confirmed the location of the hotel you booked. Do you need an auto car? Must be many people trying to apply for an auto car here, aren't there? It's off season now. Nearly no tourists are in the resort. I still want to walk. I would too. Are you kidding me? Especially in like a world where I'd never see plants like this, I hands down walk. I understand this is the map for the resort. Please check it anytime you need. The hotel is two miles away. Go over the bridge and the hotel will be on your left. If you know a car, please contact us. Uh, Strange robot. Yeah. Fuck you. These robots can only be seen in the resort specialized service robots. What is this world? Can I see the- no, fuck, fuck the resort and like the actual anime. Or the actual visual novel. Show me what the hell the world looks like. Fuck it, that'd be nice. Outside the robots are all dumb and strong. Maybe only some holiday resorts will use such robots. Jeez. Let's go to the hotel. Uh-huh. Let's go. Daisy took my hand and went one step forward. Looking at the clear blue sky, I smiled. Even though I know that the clear blue sky is man-made... Because of the hand that I'm holding, everything is so beautiful. 
Oh my god, what is it wrong with this world now that I think about it? So why am I okay, this is a ceremony for us to enter society. Alright, so let me do some quick thought process here. So my idea is, is that the outside world is like destroyed, it's been like abused by mankind, plants aren't as easy to find, resorts like this are few and far between. This entire thing is domed over because he said the blue sky was fake. And I'm going to assume that when he said money is useless once you go to college, I'm assuming that after you graduate from college or while you're in college you get a credit based system where your effort is turned into like whatever the hell you need instead of actually using money. And that's why once you go to college you don't really need it because you'll already be all set as long as you work hard and study. We all on the same page here, what my theory is? Alright, good, let's continue on. And the graduation trip to become an adult. Jesus Christ. Also, the last time I can spend time, I can, this is also the last time I can spend, okay, now I'm actually sad. A couple that's going to be separated and a memory that is going to be forgotten. This is the last taste remaining of my youth. Jesus. That's actually a little bit sad. What? Oh, <laughs> wow. <laughs> what? <laughs> sure is. The things I don't know about. Inside the show, where some kind of artifacts and decorations. It's a sweet shop, you jackass! Different styles of over luxurious dress located across the street. I only seen those in video day before. God, how destroyed is the world? We didn't even dare look at the price tag. <laughs> no matter what, nothing is affordable for us. And not everything can be bought with money here. Many things can be traded with tickets only given by the government. I knew it! There was some sort of a credit system based on hard work and merit. Actually, if you guys want to read another story that's similar to this one in the style where merits and credits and tickets are given out, go read the Ugly series Scott, by Scott Westerfield, mainly so you can read the spin-off book Extras. It takes place in a world just like this where, except nature is rampant and cities are few and far between. That's what the whole series takes place on. In the fourth book, the spin-off, takes place where the world has to rebuild itself after a huge incident in the third book and it, they switch over to a credit system which is based on merits or popularity so the visitors for these holiday resorts are mostly are mostly resorts are mostly government officials or capital what the fuck grammar much and I might be the only people who will need this stuff me let's go I want to see more. You'll be sad if you do because nothing is affordable. Aww. I know, I just want to look around. Girls shopping doesn't necessarily mean really have to buy something. In that case, why not go into the store then? Maybe we can check on the price tag for everything and see how many years we need to work to afford that. <laughs> but actually, it's impossible to get them if you don't have tickets. Nah, this is enough for me. I would seriously consider buying them if I went in. <laughs> Whoa, look at that ahead. What? Where? <laughs> she has way too much energy. She dragged me for a while. Over the crossing is a long bridge. The bridge is just a straight run on the other side of the river. God, this place is cool. Oh my, there are actually fucking houses down. How rich? That's really long. Serious amount of time. So our hotel should be right past the bridge then. That's right. Oh god. Are you sure you still want to walk through all this? Yes. <laughs>
but we'll be exhausted. Unless you can see those views. God damn it. <laughs> Walking on the side of the railing, I stick out my head to see what's under the bridge. A clear river is flowing gently below. I can't even see different colors of fish when we sigh if you look carefully enough. A few ducks wandering around on the river. Suddenly a duck sticks his head in the water and catches a fish himself. <laughs> catches himself a fish. <laughs> what do you think? Oh god. I've never seen somewhere like this before. I heard the resort was good, but this is totally beyond my imagination. Hopefully this isn't the last time to be here. The only bad thing about here is too expensive. That's true. If someday I can find a great job with a fine salary, we'll be able to come here again. Possibly. But it's all after college, right? Just take it slow. <laughs> but if only judged by beautifulness, you are the winner. Dude! Dude, coming in clutch with the, like, freaking smooth talk. Of course you are. You know, say, love is blind. Even if it is without love, you are still cute. It exists by itself, not by me. Men are more handsome when they get serious. I like it more when you're not serious. Do you? <laughs> like a calming relief. Oof. So I guess I will never be serious again. <laughs> never serious boyfriend. <laughs> but love is blind. I know that, but who said that? Maybe someone famous in history. But they never teach history in school, and not many history books exist in- <gasps> What the fuck is wrong with this world? Like, dude, hold up on the visual novel for half a second. Explain the world a bit better. I'm tired. <laughs> Only one third! It's so long, we should get an auto car to the hotel. <laughs> Take it easy, look at those views. It's always the same view, I'm bored. That is what's called romantic being bored out of my mind? Oh shit. Birds. Huh? I follow a finger and point at the sky. A few birds are chasing each other. That is a real bird, not a machine. I've never seen that bird before. Really? When we were still children in the museum we went to, it was bird specimen day, don't you remember? Didn't believe birds can fly. But they didn't tell us. They said that knowledge is pointless for you. God, what the fuck is wrong with this world? So you said, if it is, why do we still have a museum for it? So we got kicked out. <laughs> so basically, you question the society. <laughs> Bitch slap comes out of left field. <laughs> yes, we did. And that was the time we started knowing each other. Alright, that's actually something I realized. Because when I was looking at the actual kanji script for this, the word knowing translate badly. It should be conversing or talking with, not knowing each other. It was. Oh, jeez. I might have, but it doesn't matter anymore. Anyway, I don't care about such a thing anymore because it's really pointless. There's just so many things more worth caring about than that. And the museum is all gone now. Huh? Mm hmm Let's go. What's wrong? <laughs> oh. Fingers interlocked. Her hand feels soft and comfortable. The first time we held hands was a few years ago. At the time, we didn't know what it meant. But as long as I'm holding her hand, I feel relieved. Then we learned how to be lovers, though. TV series... Then we learned how to be lovers through TV series online. I learned to hug, to hold hands. 
We did that for years, although I didn't know whether we can keep doing this in the future. At least in these two days we can. We're halfway through. It's still far. No wonder no one is around. <laughs> because it's the off season. But we are lucky. It's like we own the place. Hold on a second, my glasses are there. Can't read shit right now. Good enough for now. It's gonna be a little foggy, but whatever. That's true. <laughs> How? In, yeah, it would be kind. Sounds bad. How can two? Pe how can people live without living each other? Not living together. Now, how can Adam and Eve live? Oh. Oh shit. Please tell me this is not a religious world where all history has been erased and religion took over. Please, God, I'd stop playing this game immediately. Maybe because in that time there was a better place to live in. But now a human can't live without society. Wherever you go, you're still a part of it. This is starting to sound like a brave new world. The only way to live with it is to become useful to it. Uh oh. I might have some problems to solve. I need to go to the bathroom. <laughs> Man, it was such a hurry today when I came here, so I didn't have time to finish the job. It didn't feel urgent enough when we were at the station. <laughs> After I noticed it, which is now, it is very urgent. <laughs> Jesus, <laughs> it's coming. <laughs> She's panicking. The summer's around. Can I in the river? <laughs> of course you can. not Hey, can we call the robot? Hey, you can guess an out card at the hotel. What? Leave it to me. <laughs> did he? Did he actually have to take a shit, or was that just an excuse? <laughs> Hello, thanks for calling. How can I help you? We really need an out card to the hotel. Confirm the out card is on its way. The out card will be arriving in 15 minutes. No, I can't hold it for 15 minutes. What to do? What to do? This is bad. Do you have any types of card vasculis? What? If you do, there's some first aid medicines and a ventilator. We can also contact your personal doctor if you show your ID card. We don't have a personal doctor. We haven't finished college yet. We are just... Uh-oh. What's wrong? It's coming out. Oh, God. How can I help you? Nothing, nothing, it's nothing. You are back in this year. Dad shows your heart rate is high. Prepare for scanning. <laughs> it was only to scan complete. A great pressure has been detected in your bladder. He's gonna piss. Of course it has. If you need to urinate, a toilet is 1.5 feet away. Can you be slower? <laughs> what a relief. My bad time, the atmosphere is all ruined. Hope she won't laugh at me. Where is she? Daisy? Daisy? Hello, Daisy? Hmm. I read behind me. It's familiar. With the taste of her. Woo! <laughs> Deja vu <laughs> again. That's just like hugging you from the back. Why not from the front? Because I won't get nervous. I you from the oof. We've been together for this long. You still feel nervous? I'm the one who should be nervous. Huh? I can't find you. That makes me scared. I thought you might have been caught by those weird robots. So uh, <laughs> fine, fine. Don't be nervous. She comes close to me, gently petting me on the head. Like a feeder who is nursing her own child. What the fuck is wrong with this world? When I was a baby, the feeder and the nursing institutions always did that to me. When a baby got scared or cried, they would comfort me. What the fuck? Is this a brave new world? Hello and welcome. Your idea has been confirmed. Please follow directions to your room. Are you two a couple? Mm, yes. You two seem very young. Because we just graduated from high school. That's why. Can I college in a few days? Sadly. The maid looked at us with a strange face. I know what makes her do that. No only everyone would do the same once they knew. 
but her face changing back and smiled peacefully. A smile is pure and natural. Because of her work, she smiles from her true heart. Rich and wealthy, only the highly educated people would have that smile. Looks like the work is here. I'll graduate from college. Just after two days, Daisy and I will go to college too. And after that, we might get the same smile as her. Hmm, it is great. It's many times bigger than my dorm room. Neat and clean, designed to make us comfortable. Alright, before I have an actual aneurysm, I'm gonna end the recording here. I'll, I'll finish this video, this series, before I go to college, because I'm leaving on Saturday. And this is hitting a little too close to home right now. This is giving me, like, anxiety problems. <laughs> but anyways, though, thank you all for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Lingering Fragrance Part 2. This anime makes me, This visual novel makes me sad. Whatever. Thank you all for watching. I'll see you next time, mates.